In this video I want to show you how to make a leopard pattern. It looks so easy, you just make the spots and you just frame it with black paint. But it seems to be that there are a few tips that you could learn to make it look natural and real. And that's what you're going to learn in this video. So let's go ahead and start. You will need a one piece of sheet from the acrylic pad and acrylic paint, white, yellow naples, yellow ochre, burnt sienna, burnt umber, and black. These are Amsterdam paints, and I'm sure you're going to need also two paint brushes, one flat one and one round one. Okay, so let's start with the background of the leopard print. We're going to use the yellow naples with a flat paintbrush, just paint the surface. Use both three colors, the yellow naples, yellow ochre and white and just blend these colors together nicely. Okay, very good. Now that you're done, just let it dry. And take your round paintbrush. I use the round Recab paintbrush. It's a synthetic number eight. And start with the darker colors, the burnt sienna and the burnt umber. And uh, paint large spots in different directions and different, spa uh, different shapes. I turn the brush here and there with the paint on it so it makes interesting shapes. Now as you come along you could gradually start painting a smaller spots and also lighter spots. You stop using the dark burnt umber and uh, use more sienna and add the uh, yellow ochre. You could make also as you see over here, I doubled my paintbrush with two uh, colors, the burnt sienna and the yellow ochre. And now that I'm done, I'm going to start painting the frame. So the frame actually looks very simple, but there is there are a few uh, tips how to make them beautiful and natural. Uh, first of all, uh, frame these spots with uh, zigzaggy motion and uh, don't make them uh, round 100%, make them look uh, wavy. And um, you could either frame them with a, a circle, like the whole, uh, cover up the whole spot, like the letter O, and you can also frame it like uh, a letter U which has one side open and you can also frame like two parentheses okay now if you see you have spaces that has no uh, spots you could just add black dots over there and the spots should also be in different shot sizes and directions. This pattern actually took me a, a good 20 minutes to paint and design. Uh, so, of course, I just speed it up a little bit. Now I see that the there are some spots that are look too dark together with the black around it. So I just added some yellow ochre on top of it while the paint is still wet.
as you paint the frames, you see if you see spaces, you could either um, fill them in with dots or just make the frame a little longer or wider so that it fills in the space. This is a very natural pattern. You could use it um, on paper in a scrapbook or you could even paint it on a wall and you could uh, just make a line on the wall with this pattern. You could uh, use it as makeup on your fingernails. You could use it also in uh, on a canvas. You could paint it on canvas and just hang it on the wall um, as uh, something that adds color in a light ochre room. Beautiful. Isn't that nice? Wonderful. There are sheets with this pattern, pocketbooks, accessories, and lots more. Now that you know how to do it, you could even do some makeup with it for costumes. So just have fun with this. See you at my other videos. Bye-bye for now. Let me know if you liked it.